The County Sheriff Neil Elk says several weeks ago, deputies received multiple tips about illegal activity, including prostitution. That led them to 58-year-old Thomas Wade Jr. We started realizing that um, he was he was involved with uh, posting things on Craigslist as well as Backpage and that investigation led to the arrest. Detectives say Wade was promoting more than 30 females over the internet for prostitution. They believe the prostitution did occur at Wade's house before it got too big then he started driving women to other locations. In his mind he was serving his community by helping them get off drugs by um, providing them with a Work. Deputies say Wade was running his prostitution ring out of his apartment here. Now, if you take a couple steps with me to the left, you'll see Trinity Christian Academy. If we keep going to the right of the building, we'll see Eastern Elementary School. Sheriff Elk says there are always extra concerns about having illegal activity near school buildings. People selling drugs possess phones. People that are selling stolen property, selling stolen guns. Um, any kind of discharge or violence that would take place, you have a stray bullet that could go somewhere. That's the biggest thing we're concerned about. It. Byron Phillips has lived next door to Wade for several months. He says Wade had two women that would stay at his apartment, but Wade told him the women were his girlfriends. I can't say that he's, what he's done was visible to the community, because like I said, I stayed right next door, and I never would have, you know, I never noticed or realize anything like that was going on. Sheriff Elk says the investigation into Wade's alleged prostitution ring is still ongoing and more arrests could come. Reporting in Greenville, Nicole Ford for News Channel 12.